Are you someone who plays too much video games? If so, you may be diagnosed with a gaming disorder. Believe it or not, as silly as that sounds, the World Health Organization has officially announced gaming disorder as a mental health condition. Now, what exactly is a gaming disorder? Well, the description or little definition about gaming disorder says, gaming disorder is characterized by a pattern of persistent or reoccurring gaming behavior, digital gaming or video gaming, which may be online, i.e. over the internet or offline manifested by one impaired control over gaming eg onset frequency intensity duration termination context to increasing priority given to gaming to the extent that gaming takes precedence over other life interests and daily activities and three continuation or escalation of gaming despite the occurrence of negative consequences the behavior pattern is of sufficient severity to result in significant impairment in personal family social educational occupational or other important areas of function the pattern of gaming behavior may be continuous or episodic and reoccurrent. The gaming behavior and other features are normally evident over a period of at least 12 months in order for a diagnosis to be assigned, although the required duration may be shortened if all diagnostic requirements are met and symptoms are severe. Now guys, as of Monday, June 18th, gaming disorder is actually going to be classified as a mental health issue. And uh, based off the reading here from the description, you have this mental mental health disorder if you just basically let video games take precedence over your time when it comes to pretty much everything and anything you can think of that is not gaming which is very very vague honestly and I'm gonna be honest yeah gaming can be pretty dang addictive like I do remember as a kid you know during like family car rides or even eating at the dinner table I would play my Pokemon games or on my Game Boy or, or on my Nintendo DS I would play my Mario you know it, it really is addictive not gonna lie However, playing video games is not a bad thing. If you honestly really think that gaming is something that's an epidemic in society with teens, young adults, and kids, then seriously, just calm the hell down. If that's the worst thing you can think of that your kid or family member is doing, then shit, to me, it seems like they're doing a pretty dang well job at life. At least instead of doing drugs or messing around on the streets, they're playing video games. You know, think about that. Would you rather have your kid messing around on the streets or would you rather have them playing video video games think about that gaming really has done a lot for people and that's one thing I really wish more adults and people from the baby boomer generation would really understand like I've met so 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 many great people online just by playing a simple video game I've built so many amazing memories and friendships just from playing a game and even posting videos on a game but still like I do see how gaming can be addictive for sure like I said but still I don't let games decide if I want to go in for work today or if I want to go to school today so do play your games don't feel bad about doing it either because of this stupid little mental disorder issue that came out but you know do play in moderation because I do feel that you should have a personal life to go along with your online life I feel that a whole lot of this ordeal is really caused by the media and you know overbearing family members like back a few years ago they all thought rock and roll was the devil or cartoons will rot your brain out that kind of stuff they're gonna cause violence I don't know, all of this just seems like craziness to me, and uh, yeah, I guess now they are targeting gamers, so I don't know, I really don't see the difference than people who, who, you know, like to watch football games every single Sunday or Monday, and they have little shrines all over their house of, of their favorite teams, you know? I don't know, just, just let people live their damn lives, for God's sakes. As long as they're not doing anything bad, as long as they're not bothering you, just let them enjoy their damn lives. So, that's my little rant about this, guys. Tell me your thoughts about it down below in the comments. Also, drop a like on the video if you guys did enjoy and thanks for watching till next time i'll see you guys later paratroopers inbound great work they are in full retreat 